This is Oppo A78 5G and today I would like to demonstrate that you can set up parental controls on this device. So first step is to launch settings, then find and open the password, password and or excuse me the accounts category or users and accounts. Then remove all the Google accounts if you have any to begin with. After that get back to the main settings page and enter the Google category. Now tap at the parental controls, get started, child routine, next. In here sign into your child's Google account. Then proceed with the Google login as you would normally do after entering the Google account credentials. Once signed into, choose this account from the list over here. Then enter another Google account credentials, this time for the Google account belonging to you as a parent or Google account that you will be using to supervise your child's activity. At the About Supervision page, you will need to type in the child Google account password one more time, then tap at the agree button, then go for the allow, wait for the parent and child accounts to get linked together. After that, tap at the next button. This step we can skip, as well as the following one. Then if the device that is highlighted over here is the, uh, it, I mean, uh, if the device that is highlighted over here or written at the bold font is the device that you will use to supervise your child, you can tap at the blue install family link button and get the required app automatically downloaded and installed on your phone. Or you can absolutely do that manually. So I'll just go for the manual way. Now take whatever phone or tablet you planned to use to supervise your child and as I've already mentioned, download and install the Family Link app. Once the app is ready, you can just go ahead and launch it. In here, sign into the parental Google account. And in the Family Link app, you can do all kinds of stuff such as setting the daily usage limits and downtime routine for a child, as well as app limits, or well, practically enable or disable any app you want, as well as set the app usage limits. So per se, you will have an opportunity to restrict your child TikTok usage for like hour a day or so, or something like that. Then you can monitor your child's app activity in general over here. You can also apply content restrictions and age filters for apps, configure your child's account settings, then manage devices if you have multiple uh, people to look after, then you can monitor your child's location and see the child's device usage highlights. Alrighty, so that will be it for this video guys, thanks for watching and bye bye.